Hey guys, Silence here, here. Welcome back to the Uta Macross Gacha video. It was only just yesterday that uh, I put up the Gacha for Cheryl, and today we have Ranka joining the lineup, and that's what we're all here for. Well, because Ranka has never gotten a red dress before in the official artworks um, for Macross Frontier. So, this red dress that you see now that she's wearing is similar to what Cheryl has but Cheryl has her dress in the forms of illustrations for the Macross Frontier Blu-ray Volume 3 if you guys have not seen it before I will leave an image here and of course Ranka's dress is well designed similarly towards Cheryl's design but this dress however is an exclusive for Utha Macross she has never worn this one before in any of the illustrations out there for Macross Frontier so very exciting for Ranka fans and of course for me because she is my waifu I am definitely going to try and unlock her costume today hopefully with at least two, two template pools of the gacha itself so let's do this guys let's take a look at Ranka's brand new episode plate and see whether her episode plate is actually on par with Cheryl's or if not you know somewhat of a decent standard for at least Ranka fans to try and obtain the episode plate knowing that you know her episode plate can be useful in terms of hardcore gameplay as well so let's take a look at the episode plate immediately let's take a look at the first page first 3605 for total score pretty decent um, most of the new tier plates are around this total range as we've mentioned in the last gacha video um some somewhat well balanced stats around uh, more on soul and of course charm um sadly to say no center skill of s rank but an a rank instead so immediately we can tell ranka's plate is not meant to be used as a center position plate her plate is meant to be a support episode plate so total up it's what the center skill is units total is boosted by 20 percent up so we can just ignore the center skill because that's kind of a pointless thing and of course let's move on to the active skill life recovery of 30 percent um not the best life recovery active skill out there 50 percent is what we've seen as the highest and of course anything below 50 percent is pretty much um non-existent kind of it is still usable but still not as useful as 50 percent all right so life skill which is what we are here for and immediately we see score and damage level five so straight away we know what this does for at the 48 second mark for 16 seconds every second your life is depleted by 20 hp and of course you get the 100 percent boost in score so will ranka's plate actually be useful in terms of high score achieving i guess it's okay it's i would say it's the new tier 2 uh, version of ranka's episode plate um because well she does have a pretty decent total score and of course the life skill is very awesome as well in terms of high score achieving especially for yellow color songs all right but sadly to say she doesn't come with any special notes attached to it so i would say ranka's episode plate isn't exactly as useful as cheryl's because cheryl's is actually an active um or rather a center position episode plate that has a great active skill as well so Ranka, sadly to say, your episode plate is slightly below Cheryl's in terms of use usefulness. Um, but of course, that life skill support with the uh, with this amount of total stats on this episode plate, it makes it on a whole new level of um, usefulness as compared to Ranka's older episode plates. So, uh, Ranka fans, if you are here to try and obtain your waifu's episode plate, of course, to replace the older ones that you have. Um, in your collection of course this plate is definitely a must-have in terms of improvement so guys I'm gonna do two pools of templates and hopefully enough I will be able to obtain Ranka's brand new episode plate if not you know try to unlock her costume as well all right so guys let's do this um, I'm not gonna use up the rest of the 400 plus singing stones because I kind of want to save up for the next gacha that's coming um, in the future you know so Hmm, let's see. Hopefully with all the bad luck we've been having this time round, Ranka shines some light onto Gacha itself. So immediately the first pool there is no Valkyries at all, so that's kind of a bummer. Uh but yeah, alright, so one red box on the first bling. 
two red boxes, so there is still a chance that there's an evolution that could happen, you know. But that doesn't mean that we will actually get the um, brand new exclusive episode plate. So no evolution there, but we do get a sight of a brand new plate I've never seen before. So hopefully this belongs to Ranka's costume. It does have Osmali uh, in it, so there is a chance. <laughs> Alright, so let's move on to the second box which is not going to evolve as well. So this entire template pool is a dud. Alright, so no evolution there as expected. Oh, we get the cute young adorable Elto. Okay, so definitely a new plate as well for me. So let's see. And there we go, we got costume points for Ranka's brand new uh, Unfini Pure costume. So that's the name of the cons costume itself. Um, Alright, so a few plates evolving, that's not too bad. So there we go. Alright, so let's take a look at the new ones and see which costume points they belong to. So this one belongs to Ranka. Does this belong to Ranka? No, it belongs to Cheryl Shudi Star. Alright. Okay, how about this? Ranka's costume. So I guess we've got... Oh wow, we've got a few variations of um, costume points here and there. Alright, so... I'm gonna reset the luck. We're gonna exit out and enter again. Hopefully, um, this time round the luck isn't as bad. So there we go. The second round of template pools. Hopefully, we've got some better luck. We do have a bit of loading there, so there is a chance, I suppose, that this time round it might be better. Hopefully. <laughs> All right. Here we go. So one, two, three. No golden orb, no 4-5 planes. Okay, that's fine. So no red boxes on the first blink, that's kind of a bummer. One red box, oh no, that's not a good sign at all. Alright, so we've seen in the past that normal boxes do evolve to rainbow ones, so I don't know whether this might happen or not. I'm just hoping that red box actually evolves to a rainbow one. There we go, lots of repeats. Okay. Alright, so the only red box is not evolving. We do get young Cheryl, so we get all the chibi characters at these in the two pools of templates. That's kind of interesting in a way, but kind of a bummer for my money. Alright, so let's take a look at this Cheryl plate and see who does it belong to. And it belongs to Cheryl, of course. And sadly to say, this does not look good for me. And this is a horrendous gacha video. Hey <laughs> guys. Um, yeah, so if you guys are Ranka fans, hopefully your luck is way better than mine. That's sadly to say, Ranka did not come through this time round for me. And I'm probably going to have to um, try and search for her plates in the future when reissue uh, of the gacha comes again. Uh, until then guys, uh, hopefully you guys uh, find all the information I share useful as always. Let me know by hitting the like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed just yet. And share the video to all your friends who are playing Utama Cross. If not, then I'll see you guys in the next uh, gacha video. Bye!